Hi, this is Tim of the 1916 Company at Dubai Watch Week 2023. I'm here with Antonio Calce, CEO of Grubel Forsey. We have a host of novelties for this year, and I want to just thank you for your time. First, thank you. Thank introduce you. me to some of what's changing, because we've got both different case sizes and new case yeah. materials for the double balance and the balancier. Um, for me, it's not a real, it's, it's not a change, it's, a, it's an evolution. Uh, it's an evolution, uh, uh, and it's true that um, this year we, we, we launch a new, a new materials, carbon fiber. Um, what, what, what was the goal, uh, all this co the convex collection? It was really to build a strong signature, a strong identity for the brand with this really specific case. And we have on this, on this case, uh, 41.5 millimeters for the first time. Uh, we have different caliber inside. This one, we have the, the double uh, the double balancier, we have the simple balancier, and we have also, we launch a flat balancier in two weeks uh, at 160. This is the double balancier, carbon fiber, 88 grams. Um, our fixed inventions with the differential uh, on the middle, and uh, it's really a cool watch because really, um, 80 grams, really, really uh, light, and uh, and yeah, thanks to this evolution, we reach also a new clientele, and it was important for us. Now it's interesting to me because you haven't worked with carbon fiber before, and now you've jumped straight into it. Balancier Convex S2, you've got a carbon fiber movement and a carbon fiber case. This is actually carbon fiber inside and out, and I guess my interest here is that you're doing something you've never done before. Why now? Again, I think it was important to have, um, you know, when I started four years ago, uh, we had a very nice discussion with Robert Grebel, uh, and we were both convinced that we need to open new doors. We, 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 we need to, it was important to reach a big size, you know, and uh, this is why we decided also to play in the new price segment. Uh, the, the average price in the past was around 500,000 Swiss francs and um, to create really a sustainable, I would say, business model, it was important to, yes, to create this, this new product offer in a new size uh, to reach a new clientele and, um, and this is exactly what we did uh, with, with all this evolution in, in, in terms of collection and today it's, it's uh, the feedback that we receive from the clients, from the connoisseur from the collectors, uh, it's it's a very strong strong message from from us. And you know, with, with this collection also, um, we reach a new clientele, new doors. Call I call this client, this new consumer, call a connoisseur. Why connoisseur? Because they really want also this add value in terms of finishing, because one third of the of the price, the retail price is hand finishing, and this is also very important to uh, for us uh, to push always the boundaries in terms of finishing and uh, and yeah, and also a youngest clientele today. Uh, it's fantastic that we have younger people than 30, 35 years old uh, come to us and say, "Wow, this is really cool." I, I, and this is it, and it was a goal again. It was a goal. So it's kind of like Rolls Royce, which used to have a very aged clientele, then they started going with the black badge, more driver-oriented cars like the Wraith and the Ghost, and now the average age at Rolls Royce for your customer is 43. That's what you're sort of doing with Grubel Force. You had a very veteran collector base, correct? Older, very wealthy, but also very small in numbers, and this is expanding that base. Exactly, it's totally right, and also all the all the all since the creation of the brand in 2004. Uh, the, produ the production was always 1985 time pieces per year. Yes. And it's also difficult. We are 140 people huh, in the company. It was also difficult to also to create uh, again sustainable uh, business model if you don't reach a, 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 I would say a, a size, a bigger size, you know. Yeah. And uh, thanks to this product, today we will increase also a little bit the quantities. Today we produce around 200. Uh, time pieces per year and thanks to also this price positioning it was possible for us to reduce the distribution uh, today we were we had 60 doors uh, four years ago today we have around 22 doors and the goal is really to reach 15 doors to create more value more consistency on, on uh, but you need the right product mix uh, and the right design the right size the right you know it's it's really an in-depth uh, analysis. Now, and I totally understand that. And also, there's a progression. You start with the balancier, 
double balance, and then ultimately that person can stay in the Grubel 4C family all the way to, I guess, what you could call the top of the model line, the watch is traditionally yeah. associated with the brand. Let's talk a little bit about the Tourbillon Cordain because this is probably the most exciting Tourbillon that you've launched since the 24 second, and it's faster than the Thank 24. You. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just on eight hour, eight inventions, first of all. Uh, we launched this Tourbillon Cardan one month ago, um, and it's incredible in terms of precision, in terms of, of course, complication and, and finishing. Hand finishing is just crazy. The Tourbillon, the concept is we have two cages, one uh, 48 second rotation, is the big one and the small one 16 second rotations um, where the tourbillon is uh, the, the 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 size of the balance is 12.6 millimeters is a big one inclined 30 degrees um, and i think it's 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 a uh, it's really the the the, the most accurate uh, tourbillon ever made at, uh, at global force and also in terms of finishing, uh, the, the grenema in the two plates, the, 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 the black polished. Yeah, it's, it's, really, it's really a piece of art. And, uh, and talking about um, the rarity and the exclusivity on this kind of product, we decided to, to produce only 11 time pieces per year for, the, for five years only. And after that, we stopped the caliber. And so 55 examples of a unique caliber and then you stop. Absolutely. To, so now, to create value and rarity. This is, I definitely don't want to cut you off, but this is beyond belief. And I got to ask about the relative contributions of Robert Grubel and Stephen Forsey, because I know they do very different things. Uh, talk about the different angles they work when designing a watch, because I know Robert's more on the aesthetic side, Stephen's often a lot more technical. You know, today we have what was the goal when I started four years ago? Uh, Robert asked me to put in place a management, me, a management team because it's also important to have a transition uh, between founders and management team. And I am really close with Robert and all the strategic vision. Uh, uh, it's, 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 a, it's a really uh, our job, you know what I mean? Uh, and again, we, we have 22 people in the R&D department, 22. You know, engineers, uh, mathematicians, physicians, and this is why today it's 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 very, really good for the brand because uh, uh, we have an incredible history, we have an incredible uh, DNA, and I think the management team that we we have today at Global Force is really the, the, they are really the right or the right people to really to continue to 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 to, to support this incredible project with exactly in the same in the same I will say the same. Uh, signature of the brand and uh, and it's also it, it's, it was also important to do that for us antonio thank you so much Thanks. i really appreciate this thanks